Within this video, we're going to run through how to change the engine scalability settings in Unreal 4 and 5. Now, these settings will allow you to work on much more complex scenes, or if you open up a project and you find that you're chugging pretty hard, like you've got bad frame rate, you'll be able to set these, and it's a real quick and easy way to get up and running quickly. So inside of Unreal 4, we can actually see what our frame rate is by coming over to this little spot right here. And we'll just drop this down, and I'm going to say Show FPS. And what we're looking for is this little set of green numbers over here. So we've got 120 frames, and we're running at 8.33 milliseconds per frame. That's how long it's taking to actually draw one of these. Now, look more for the milliseconds more than the frame rate. So if we want to set it for a machine that's not nearly as powerful, just come up to your settings. Okay, and then come down here to the engine scalability settings, and you can change all of this stuff right here, which is great. Now, I would suggest just hitting the auto button just to kind of see what your machine needs. And of course, you can turn these down as needed. You can also set the material quality right here and your preview rendering right here to see what kind of uh, device you're actually working on. So that's Unreal 4. So let's take a look at Unreal 5. So in here inside of Unreal 5, you'll actually find these over here in the far right-hand corner for settings right here. So settings, and we can come down here, but here's our engine scalability settings. Again, you have an auto, you have your material, and you have your preview rendering. And if you want to check your frame rate, you can just come all the way over here to this. Click this one, and you can show your frame rate right here. So there you go. Now you know how to set up the engine scalability settings for a machine that may not be super powered.